Well, 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 if it isn't Jojo Siwa, appearing as though she just auditioned for the reboot of Mad Max. Now, don't get me wrong, it's a bold move, but I'm not sure if the post-apocalyptic look is in season this year. She strutted her stuff at the iHeartRadio Music Awards, sporting a black mesh bodysuit, dramatic face paint, and a faux hawk. I mean, who knew JoJo was planning to moonlight as a roadie for a heavy metal band? And it seems like she's trying to transition into her adult era with a new song. I guess the lyrics, I'm a little bit of punk, a little bit of rock, didn't quite have the impact she was hoping for, so she thought, why not embody that in the most literal way possible? And let's not forget the alternating between a bad girl image and a more conventional appearance. But Jojo Darling switching between personas faster than a quick change artist at a magic show can give us all a bit of whiplash. But hey, she's confident, she's bold, and she's certainly making a statement. If that statement is, I rated the costume department of a B-grade rock opera, then mission accomplished. But all jests aside, kudos to Jojo for embracing her evolving persona and not being afraid to stand out. Even if that means looking like she's about to start a mosh pit at any given moment. So there you have it folks. Jojo Siwa, child star, YouTube sensation, and now, apparently, the front woman of a punk rock band nobody knew existed. We can't wait to see what she'll come up with next. Maybe a polka dotted jumpsuit with a neon mohawk? Only time will tell.